Hello, I'm Drew Bartlett, Executive Director for the South Florida Water Management District. I'm talking to you from our Operations Center, which is manned 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 365 days a year to do flood control and water supply for South Florida. We are experiencing Hurricane Ian, which is a very powerful storm, which brought significant storm surge and is bringing significant rainfall to the South Florida Water Management District. For the East Coast canals, that rainfall was felt yesterday and last night. Those canals serve as the main artery to take drainage from local governments to a main interstate artery and away from those communities. And I'm happy to report that throughout the event, those canals performed as intended. They are now receding, they've reached their peak, and that peak stage never came close to going out of banks. Now for the West Coast, uh, that significant storm surge uh, really overwhelmed the Big Cypress Basin coastal salinity structures. So the South Florida Water Management District manages those canals and those coastal structures, and those did create some flooding for those communities. Our field station staff will be deployed first thing in the morning once it's all cleared to go and investigate the drainage. It will take a while for that drainage to then go back out of the system into the ocean. They will be looking for opportunities to make that drainage more efficient and help assist with that drainage. Now, if you are facing life-threatening uh, flooding, please go ahead, dial 911. The hurricane is now moving inland and it will bring rainfall to the Kissimmee Valley and the upper Kissimmee chain of lakes. Uh, it's gonna be significant and that rain, you can expect the river and those lakes to rise rapidly because of the rainfall as the hurricane goes through. As we respond to our systems uh, with the assets we have, we are stand ready to help any uh, local governments if they have any needs and we can be of assistance. Now, our Advertency Operations Center is in full lock activation. We are here through the night in lockdown and we will certainly monitor and respond and manage the storm as it makes its way across the South Florida Water Management District. I encourage everyone to continue listening to messages from your County Emergency Operations Center, and please, the storm is still here, please be safe. Thank you.